Hi, I'm Tony Eels and this is Dogs Queensland Video News Channel. We're now doing show two of the Ipswich Kennel Club shows for Sunday the 9th of, <laughs> the 9th of June. And uh, we're just getting ready now. The judge today doing general specials is Mrs. Jocelyn, Jocelyn Cagney from Canada. So we have our Group 1 dog just getting ready. It looks to me to be the same Cavalier from group from the last group and we're just getting ready for general specials now where the toy is about to make its way into the ring <laughs> and here we have the cavi the open dog winner of the group he's had a great day this is his second best in group the staffordshire bull terrier i believe it was an open bitch group three is a springer spaniel Lovely dog. I actually had the pleasure of judging this dog yesterday myself. We have the Rhodesian Ridgeback from the Hound Group. Here we have my favourite Kelpie. Black Open Dog. Group 6. We have the reverse of today. This morning show we have the Junior Rottweiler Dog. And group seven is the Kieshund. Of course, handled by my favorite kitty. Once again, a lovely lineup of, of exhibits. Well, 450 was right around. Kelly had done us down the back and off we go, going around. That beautiful Blenheim cabbie. Now we have the Stafford. Very moderate open bitch. <laughs> and judge of group two today was Mr. Reese Fry, who is a long time Stafford breeder. Always interesting when you get a, a specialist. Of course, they will have certain things they love, certain things they hate. But it was his best in group winner. The win under a specialist was always very special. Stafford makes his way around to the end of the line. You have the Springer, English Springer Spaniel. He was my best in show winner yesterday at the specialty. I believe uh, found out today he just recently earned his supreme championship still only a young dog the English Springer Spaniel makes his way to the end of the line 
Here we have a Ridgeback. I believe an open dog. We've had a lot of Ridgebacks here today. I believe there's 38 exhibited today. They had uh, Ridgeback specialty up here this weekend. Many specialties, boxer specialties, springer specialties, uh, fox terrier specialties. Huge weekend, show weekend here. Always was a Queen's birthday long weekend here in Queensland, but no longer the Queen's birthday was moved. But we still have a huge show weekend and today is a two-day Albreed show and tomorrow we will have, on Monday, we still have an Albreed show. The Rhodesian Ridgeback makes its way out and back. And round he goes to the end of the line. The open dog, the Rhodesian Ridgeback, the winner of the Hound Group. Now my favourite, well-trained Black Kelpie. I believe he won the Kelpie specially yesterday as well. Expertly handled. Classic, great Australian working dog. Okay, Miss Cagney is going to send that Kelpie down and back. That beautiful working movement of a Kelpie. Off we go to the end of the line. <laughs> the Kelpie. Then we have the working dog, or the utility dog, the, the Rottweiler, the junior dog. Of course, was runner-up in the first show, runner-up in group. This young dog has a promising career. He's really started to hit his straps now. As fairly consistently doing well in the utility group, in group six. And he's about to make his way on his down and back. The Rottweiler. Make his way round to the end of the line. Now the Keeswand. This dog has been as high as number two in the country this year. There's Johnny, is his name. One of the Spitz breeds, of course, and a very popular breed of dog in Group 7. And we have a number of outstanding exhibits of this breed up and down the eastern seaboard and in South Australia. Consistent winners in Group 7, the Keeswand. Off we go on the down and back. Performing very well. Round to the end of the line. Yay, go kitty. Um, 
Mrs. Cagney has made a decision already. I'm unsure what breed as she has, but we have our best in show rosette in hand. And we are going to. Well done. Best in show is going to be awarded to the Kelpie. Well done. Best in show has been awarded to the Kelpie, and we're going to have back now the Aussie Shepherd. Best in show winner was from the intermediate class, and now we have our Aussie Shepherd coming in and round to the table. Go over the go over the Aussie. Uh, give it a quick look. I'm about to do a stand and back. He's make his way around to the end of the line. Don't mess him. And we're going to award our runner up in show. <laughs> runner up in show is the Rottweiler. So that knocks out junior and intermediate. We have our babies coming in. Our group one winner is a baby Laotian. Group two is our baby Can, Can Terrier. Group three, a baby Bracco, the Bracco Italiano. Group four is going to be our baby Beagle. Group five is a baby Aussie, little tricolour. Group six is going to be our baby Mastiff, Bull Mastiff. I do love this dog. I call it a Pugasaurus. And we have our Jap Spitz is our baby in Group 7. A lovely lineup of babies here tonight for Show 2. From Mrs. Cagney from Canada to decide and award baby in Show. Laotian's now making its way down and back. Beautiful little Laotian baby. Little lion dog. Look at that cute little waggy tail. I love this breed. They're beautiful, fun little dog. May end up being my retirement dog one day. Group two winner, the baby can terrier. Exhibitor looks like she's hanging on for grim death. Ready to launch off the table to say hello to the judge. They're full of beans, the can terrier. 
fantastic family dog. Giving the judge lots of kisses. I have shown a baby can or two in my time and they are a handful. They are so full of beans, they're just a fabulous little terrier. We're going to go down and back with the can terrier. This little boy is full of himself. A little tail wagging, look at him go. It's fantastic. The can terrier. He's going to make his way around to the end of the line. Off he goes. Next will be the Bracco. Italiano, of course, an Italian pointing dog. They've become very popular in the last few years around the world. Well known for their unique movement, their huge elastic open gait. Until you see a Bracco working in the field, there are lots of videos on YouTube. They are quite an unusual breed. A Bracco Italiano. Around the Bracco goes to the end of the line. Quite a large dog in the gun dog group. The baby beagle. Baby beagles are so hard to beat because they are so cute. Very, very popular family dog, the beagle. Known for being quite mischievous. Very much a pack dog. But they are an outstanding little hound. Do I get any big keys? I'll just Yeah, the big bag there. Big thank you. Inquisitive. One of the scent hounds. <laughs> the beagle always wanted to put its nose on the ground to sniff and smell. That little tail wagging from side to side. Wants to investigate everything. The baby beagle. Now we have the little tricolour. Aussie Shepherd. Very cute and fluffy. The baby of the working group. the Aussie Shepherd on us down and back. Well, we go to the end of the line. A baby Aussie Shepherd. That cute little tricolour. We have the baby bull mastiff. Yeah. 
lovely example of the breed. My big heavy working mastiffs. Baby winner from the utility group. Very well trained, very well put together. The baby mastiff, baby bull mastiff. That black face, cute fawn body, beautiful big bum. Last but not least, the chap spits. Beautiful dark pigment on that chap spits. Beautifully presented white coat. Seven baby winner, the Jap Spitz, about to do us down and back. That will complete our baby judging. Miss Cagney can award best baby in show, and that will complete our video component of tonight's show. We'll be back here again tomorrow for day four of the show weekend and the final show in the Ipswich Kennel Club. Cluster for 2019. Baby Spitz making his way round to the end of the line. Judge is ready to make her final decision. One last walk down the line. And she's going for the ribbon. Bull Mastiff. The Pugasaurus has been awarded Best Baby in Show. That completes our judging here tonight. As I said, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching. And come back tomorrow where we will have the third and final show of, well, the fourth and final show of the Ipswich Kennel Club. Thank you and have a wonderful day.